Hey y'all, Matt here with Bobcat Bonsai, and today we are going to get our Amur Maple wired up for fall. Um, as you can see it has lots and lots of wire marks on there. Sorry, let me just focus in. Yes. There's lots and lots of wire scars on there. So we want to make sure we wrap in the opposite direction and really hope that we can get some of these scars to disappear. We have to remember to get the wire off before spring this year. That way we don't have as many issues. So, not too much to do now other than just get into it. I'm going to end up bringing the wire in from the front here. And more than anything now, we wrapped the opposite way last time, so this time we're gonna come up and through. And just really get into it. I feel like my design aspect's pretty obvious here, but in case you can't tell, I'm trying to get this in a wind, wind swept style. I just need to learn how to speak. So I'm just going to take this wire into here and that's going to let me get a bend put through on this main area right up through here. I'm then going to, let me get a little bit more adjustment there, there we go, a little bend here, yep. So that's not necessarily the bend I was going after right now but that wire will, that wire is just completely unnecessary for that little branch running out <laughs> all right so on this one i'm just going to start from back here again and i'm going to bring it around to across the bottom here And then we'll just get up and in through this spot. So we are running the same direction. So now it's important to try not to overlap, especially as we're coming through here. I want to try not to wrap up the, I want to try to not wrap up the buds that are now beginning to show. So we got a good wrap on that one. So now we need to down our wire again to something a little bit skinnier. And unfortunately I don't have anything in like a copper tone. So we will have to use more of a dark green for this one. Um, that really is unfortunate because that little copper tone was looking pretty fantastic. So on this one... I'm just going to come in and just get a quick wrap here. Nothing too over the top. Sorry, sometimes when I'm thinking I really get super quiet because I don't know why. I just get really quiet when I'm thinking. <laughs> okay. So, that is going to give me, sorry, I completely covered you up there. That's gonna give me what I need to get for these two. So now we're gonna drop the wire even smaller because this next part really really is not that big at all um yeah we should be able to do it with this little guy right here so this one's interesting because it's starting to come off it's got like a copper ish color to it and it's that dark green at the same time so we do have that going uh we are going to come down on this wire and come back and around and through because i want to make sure that 
I'm getting this full, full branch into the design all the way up to the butt on the end. So we've got that one done. That one's done. We need to come in on this one, so I'm going to come right in here. And will I keep all these branches in the long run or the end game? No. No, I will not. But for the time being, as I'm trying to get everything to thicken and get bigger, we are going to leave everything there. And that's how we're going to go about doing this full styling on this one. Alright, so for the time being, I just need to move that one out. There we go. Don't cover that low bud because we want that one. And then, as you're working your way up, it's super important to try and not. Try and make sure you're not covering up anything that you don't or that you want to keep for later or that you may possibly want to keep for later so try and not damage your buds is basically what i'm getting at okay so now we got that one done now we need to come and deal with this mess right in here and for that we're going to start it by coming over here and I don't believe this is all, or I don't believe this has had any wire on it at all because this is all a newer growth coming in and through here. So our goal is just to get in and around it all and begin its styling. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure I keep my hand out of your way, but I know I keep wrapping it right in front of you. So we'll just do a quick wire snip here. Boop. Bring this around. Excellent. Then we're just gonna have one more to run. After that, we'll get in and do a quick little bending styling. Bending and styling. Yeah, we'll go with that. Bending and styling. So this one, I'm actually gonna run the wire back a little ways because I don't have a second branch to really run it onto. And now I'm just gonna bring it around. Not ready. Get it around that last little set of leaves here. And then What was I thinking of? Oh, it's no big deal that the leaves are falling off as I'm going through this because they're hitting the point where they should all be coming down here shortly anyway. So now we got the whole tree wired up. That wasn't too bad. That was about, about eight minutes to get that done. So that's definitely not the longest it's taken me to wire something. So that's great news. Um, now that we've got it all wired up, we're going to just go through and begin the process of getting it knocked into more of a windswept shape. So I like the movement it has going through right in here. So now we just have to start the bends and get everything done. I didn't put wire on this little guy because that one's so small. I really don't know what to do with that right now, but for the rest of this, We'll just begin to get the little bends in here. So I want to bring this one back up a little ways because this one needs to come in and then sweep. Right, so now we've got this one and that one's got a little bit of movement in here. Then we have this one right in here. 
and we're gonna bring it forward a little bit and up and down and up just to kind of really get it in there now clearly once this thickens up some we'll end up cutting this back quite a ways um, then for this little branch right here I'm just gonna take it and kind of sweep it almost like a, a down and then an up a little bit like that there okay again this wire we didn't or this branch we didn't wire up at all so there's that for it um, this one I'm gonna bring up and then here's where this one's really gonna come into play we've got to really sweep it back and in this direction over and through here I may even just bring it a little bit forward and push this one back some so let this one be the forward branch and then let this big old beast right here be the back yes so for right now it is going to be in its own space that's for sure then I'm gonna take this big old one right here which this one I'm just using to thicken up back here a little bit that's gonna end up coming off then at some point it's just way too thick for where we're going so for now we're just trying to give it something to do with the design but it also make sure it stays out of everything else's way for the light so give it a purpose for the design because we don't want it just hanging out doing nothing but then at the same time we don't want it taking light from the actual design So it's not perfect and it'll look a lot nicer when the leaves are off of it and everything's running in that direction. But I want to let the leaves fall by themselves this year. So we've got it all running. Now it's all just blowing away as we go. I think it would be really cool whenever I get it repotted. If I can get it. Let's see if I can balance that just right. If I can get that right there, I think that's the exact thing we're looking for. Again, I know the leaves are massive right now because I'm letting everything grow, so the scale's way off, but I feel like it it's moving in the right direction. All right. Will it balance? It will. Let me see if I can spin it for you now while it's balancing. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you enjoy my content, you should subscribe to my channel. And if you really, really enjoy my content, you should hit the bell notification so you can get notified every time I release a new video. Thank you.